The first thing that people ought to know is that this is a true story. Uh, there was a real guy named Louis de Rougemont, and he was a bit of a celebrity of his day because uh, he wrote a series of magazine articles about this adventurous life that he had led uh, for 30 years. It's a show about a, a man who spins a tall tale. He does it in a way that stretches the boundaries of what's true and what's false. Think pirates, think marooned on a desert island. There's all sorts of twists and turns. So you never really know what to expect, but it takes you on that classic adventure journey. Well, we have a, a pretty amazing script to start with. Donald Margulies, Pulitzer Prize winning playwright. This is a very different play for him than he's usually uh, known for writing. This is theater of the imagination in its purest form. You're telling an epic story in a small space with three actors and minimal props is, is like, it's kind of mind boggling. Uh, and it took us a really long time to figure out. It's an extremely physical show. It's very demanding. We will be very, very sweaty up here after the first five minutes. <laughs> I have a cheat sheet backstage. The last three pages, there's 17 different characters I go through. It's kind of an amazing thing, considering there's only three people on that stage with a, a couple of wind whistles and a couple of trunks and a blanket. I haven't seen a show of such epic proportions in this space before. So I'm hoping that that'll be new and exciting for the audience as well. The kids are gonna love it for the imagination aspect. The adults are gonna love it because it's just a really, really good story in, in, in the best sense of the word. We really call on the audience and bring them into the, uh, the world that we're creating. The willing suspension of disbelief is something that uh, goes both ways here. And uh, uh, I just hope people find the joy in it that we find uh, as we present it.